mistake. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. I wanted to do an update video on uh, a video I had made a few years ago that was about creating a digital signature with Preview on a Mac. Uh, now, before we get started, uh, as per the comments on the previous video, I did make a mistake. We're not creating a digital signature, we're creating an electronic signature, and there is a difference. An electronic signature is essentially uh, a digital version of your signature on a page. Um, a digital signature is uh, a secure, encrypted, uh, method of signing documents digitally. Uh, and there is a difference. There's quite a bit of complicated technology behind a digital signature where an electronic signature is essentially kind of like a picture of your signature that you use on your computer. So that's what we're gonna be focusing on today. And we're going to take a look at how to create an electronic signature on both a Mac and a PC. So let's go ahead and get started. On Windows 10, my go-to application to electronically sign documents is Adobe Acrobat. Now I use Adobe Acrobat Pro because I have a Creative Cloud subscription, but if you don't want to pay for Adobe Acrobat, you can use Adobe Acrobat Reader, which is free and it can be downloaded on this web page. So if we switch to Adobe Acrobat, I've got a dummy contract opened up here and I have a line that says sign here. So if we look over to the right side, we have an icon that says fill and sign and we want to fill this out. So we're gonna use the box on the left with the button that says fill and sign. So when we click on that, we get this toolbar at the top with a number of different annotation options. And one of them has a little fountain pen icon that says sign. So we can click that and we have the option to add a signature and initials. So we're going to add a signature and I can do this one of two ways. I can actually type my signature in and it will uh, give me a nice scripty font and I can actually change the style by clicking on the right side here. I also have the option to draw my signature in, which I'm not gonna do a very good job of. So obviously that's not gonna be a, a good option. However, if I had a touchscreen computer, I could probably do a pretty nice job um, filling out my signature with my finger. The other thing is if I have a scan of my signature, I can actually upload uh, that image and then I can use the scan of my signature to fill it in. But lately I've just been using the typed signature. It works just fine and I basically can click on the uh, line and it places it and I can resize it as needed and I can click and drag and move it around. And now that signature is saved in the sign function in Adobe Acrobat. And this will work exactly the same way on a Mac. Now let's take a look at using Preview to create an electronic signature. So I've got my contract here on the desktop. I'm going to double click it and Preview will open. And of course I've got my sign here line. So to sign this electronically in Preview, what I'm going to do is hit this icon on the toolbar right here up at the top, and that will bring up some annotation tools. And one of them is a signature tool. Now I have two options. I can sign with my trackpad, which I'm not gonna do a very good job of. If you can sign things well with your trackpad, by all means you can use this. But what I'm going to do is I'm gonna use my camera to take a picture of my signature. Now I've signed a note card and I'm going to go ahead and hit camera and hold this up to the screen. And it should in a second grab my signature and then I can hit done. Now I've got my digital signature. So with this, I should be able to click this icon and select my signature and it will show up on screen and then I can resize this however I'd like. Now, I signed this with a note card. That's why there's those lines in the background. You'd be better off signing a blank piece of paper. But essentially now, my electronic signature is saved in preview and anytime I need it, I simply need to click on this icon and there's my signature. So in conclusion, Adobe Acrobat is a great option for electronically signing documents on both a Mac and PC. And of course, on a Mac, you have Preview, which is an awesome program with a ton of features, and it has a great built-in electronic signature function. Uh, now, one note, if you have a touchscreen computer, whether it's a Windows computer or a Chromebook, you can likely sign documents electronically with your finger, but we're gonna go into that in a future video. So that's all I've got for you today. Thanks so much for tuning in. As always, hit that subscribe button. We release new tech tips every weekday at noon, as well as live stream projects every weekday at 10 and 2. And make sure you check out the DAE.com for our full list of online private lessons and classes. And also, if you have an idea for a tech tip you'd like to see us make, throw it in the comments and we'll do our best. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you in the next tech tip.